That is so much hair. Oh my gosh. Hey everyone, Katrina Stack. Welcome back to my channel. For those who are new and just tuning in, welcome. So I have a really fun video. I always say that, but this one's gonna be like super fun, a huge transformation. Ranger, my horse, I'm going to clip him today. He is a big wooly bully. So let's go grab this horse and get him started. And if you guys haven't already, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, give this video a big thumbs up and turn that post notification bell so you guys are notified every time I upload a video. Oh, look at him. You are about to be clipped, boy. You ready? He's usually a jerk when I try to go grab him in the pasture. So let's see if he bears with me. Are you doing some treats? Already I told you. There's nothing more I love than chasing horses in a pasture. I should have grabbed a bucket of grain. A little bit. Please help me capture him. Rangy, don't you want to be clipped, bud? Oh, I don't think so. Nope. Ugh. Come on, dude. Please, please, no. Let mommy just see you and pet you. Oh, you're about to poop. Success. A lot easier than I thought it was gonna be. All right, now that I captured him, check out his coat. And when he is clipped, he looks like a different color of horse. Right now, he's like a mix between, hmm, it's like red, chestnutty, and then wait till you guys see him after. It's wild. Hey y'all, check his coat out. It is so thick. He definitely needs to be clipped. And he's really dirty. Everyone has their own clipping ways, and usually I would bathe them and give them a bath before, but what I'm gonna do is I'm just going to curry him really good, and then brush him, and then go ahead and just clip him. I know I'm not good with clippers anyways. I usually buy cheap clippers and then throw them out after I'm done using them on two horses because that's about all I get use out of them. So I don't believe in buying expensive clippers. I just buy literally a cheap brand of clippers. Check it out. And then I usually get two good clippings out of the horses. So it'll probably be Ranger and then one other horse this year with these. And then I buy like a bulk pack of them. So I buy probably, I have five of these. So we'll see how they work. This is my first time using this brand. And I'll let you guys know how it does. As you guys can see, Ranger's not cross-eyed. He hates being cross-eyed. The second he gets put on cross ties, he freaking freaks out and then breaks them and runs off. So he stands pretty well for me most of the time, as long as someone's watching him. Cause if I turn my back, he'll like slowly go off and then take off running. So it's pretty good though. I like him not being able to run away for the most part. I'm going to curry him though now and get all the dirt out that I possibly can. And then I'll hard brush him because check this coat out. It is like serious. I'm gonna give you guys just a close up of how thick his coat is and one more tour around him. So you guys can see the before and then the after. Sorry, bud. Don't mean to freak you out. He's actually 22 years old, believe it or not. Or wait, he's 17 when I got him with him. So he's 21 years old. And he looks really good for 21. He still jumps and does everything and you never know his age. So he's had good homes his whole life. Alrighty guys, it's time to do the clipping. So let's start from here. Oh yeah. Already so different. Woo! Wild.
You guys just missed it. Kojak keeps on giving him little love bites and it looks like Ranger's ball, <laughs> but believe it or not, he does have a lot of hair and I will do a cleanup and make it all straight lines. I'm just trying to get all the, most of the hair off because it's crazy. Most horses, when they do get clipped, they look like two different horses. Like Texas, my little Palomino buckskin paint, he looks like so different. And as well as like my old mini hatch, she, her skin looked blue, which kind of like his, but there's tons of hair here and he feels so much better. And it's gonna feel like a new horse. And then as you guys can look, all these little lines, I will go over them and make it all smooth when I'm done. And he will look like a brand new horse and feel so much better. We're gonna go ahead and clean the clippers out. Oh my gosh, check out my hand, how dirty. Disgusting. Would y'all check out all that hair so far? This done so far. But what a difference, how crazy. And all that hair. So, people would ask me, why don't you buy expensive clippers, da, da, da. The only reason why is because I have seven horses and I have to clip all my horses and I don't really take care of them that well. You know, like the clippers as, you know, and clipping horses, it takes a while. And that's just why I just buy a couple pairs of cheap ones and they do the job, job just fine. It's not like I'm showing my guys like I used to or any of that stuff, because when I used to show them, I would have someone out that was a professional that would come out and clip them, but I just do it myself. And I enjoy doing it and spending time with my horses and giving them the love and spending this time with them. So expensive clippers, I don't believe in them. That's why I just go with these and they do the job literally the same. And yeah, having seven horses and clipping seven horses a year, it's a lot of work. We are on to our first one this year, which is Ranger. And I usually do Texas or Ranger first, and then bam, my little mini, um, because he grows a really thick winter coat. But if you guys can see, his coat is so thick. Like, look at that, it's crazy. And yeah, let's get back to clipping.
We almost have one more side done. And look at all that hair I have to clean up. <sighs> it's gonna be, that's my favorite part. That and then doing the second round of clipping to make sure everything is even. Gojack always agrees, right Co? Right. I'm done with like the final product. I will leave his legs hairy and like a little bit of his belly, but I'm gonna try to do it possible, as best as possible, straight line for it. And I will leave his face besides his neck. I'll trim his neck and then do his mane, the tail. But look guys, we are like getting there. It's taken a while, but look how good he looks. He looks like a new pony. take a break halfway through because the clippers get hot and I like to give him a break as well. Check it out. Look at all that hair. I highly recommend long sleeves because horse hair, if you don't have long sleeves on, it's all over you. You guys can check it out. I'll do a close up in a minute. Literally the horse hair gets all over you. It makes you so itchy. So I always bring two pairs of clothes to change into. I have my clipping clothes and then I will change into back to my regular clothes because I am literally covered in horse hair. So much horse hair and it is so itchy. And check out all that hair. But right now while I'm letting the clippers cool off, I'm going to groom up all this hair to kind of keep the barn clean because it's getting really hairy in here. Don't move Ranger. Oh my gosh, there's so much hair. That is so much hair. Look at my foot compared to all the hair. Oh my gosh. Major, you're so, oh, great. Just what I wanted to see. Perfect. This is my favorite part of going more cities. Traveling horse feet. While I'm letting the clippers cool down and Ranger kind of take a break, I'm going to go ahead and brush his tail and mane and get a full makeover. Oh yeah, and I forgot to mention, Ranger hates fly spray bottles. You couldn't tell by the look of his face. He's like, ugh. Oh. So, when I first got him, he wouldn't even let you spray him without running. But he's gotten a lot better. And we're starting on this side. We'll start from the back, please. Kojak. 
We'll give Co on to like just put the camera away. Now play with it. Give them a little bit of a show because I feel like we're kind of being boring right now. Give your brother. And I know you guys are going to say it's super dangerous standing behind your horse's butt, but I know he would never kick me and I trust him with like my whole life. So that's the reason why I do it. If you guys know your horses, then feel comfortable doing it. If not, Alright guys, how about we do a little tour? This side is almost done. I still have to like trim out the leg better and the belly and that side. Kojak's really liking it. And over here, if we come along, I got almost his butt done. So we still have a little bit of time to work on you. And you are being so patient and wonderful. Good boy. <laughs> oh man, do I have a story for you. What a fail. I promise, Ben, I will finish you off tomorrow but you look really good from the left side the right side we're still working on it well guys you just saw ranger he just ran away from me and does not want anything to do with me and it's most likely because his clip job looks awful right now well my clippers ended up breaking so it was a total fail on my end but tomorrow i will attack him with new clippers and finish it up so stay tuned for the next video and if you guys enjoyed this video well the part-time clip job Give this video a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and turn on that post notification bell so you guys are notified every time I upload a video.